From Daily Forex, this is Chris taking a look at the U.S. stock indices. And in front of you, I have the S&P 500. That is a um, market that just kind of died on Monday, just as we have for the previous week. You can see we're right here at the, the highs, the resistance of the highs. Europe was celebrating Easter Monday. Perhaps that was part of it. But really, we didn't have much in the way of a catalyst. And you could be forgiven if you've lulled yourself to sleep here. We're down one point at almost closing time. Kind of been bouncing around in a very tight range. Five points either side of break even. I think more than likely we're going to see a pullback. That makes more sense. But I think there's plenty of support below at 2880, 2850, and 2790. Over here in the NASDAQ, we pulled back. You can see that we are at highs or broke through it a couple days ago. Slightly pulled back a couple times. And now we're forming this hammer-like candle that looks like it's just a sign of stubbornness. We're going to continue to try to grind to the upside. 70, 70, or 77.50 being broken to the upside is a sign that we'll go to 8,000. In the meantime, probably going to buy pullbacks here as well.